Today we're taking a look at the ProLogic series, SafeLock system from SecureM, and specifically we're looking at the wireless functionality. We build in to this ProLogic series and some models of our ScanLogic biometric series a wireless receiver transmitter into each of the SafeLock systems. And we use that transmitter for a number of functions. We can program to the lock using a specific piece of software and some hardware to be able to wirelessly program each of the safe locks. We can do that either locally or across a network um, using something called a wireless access point. Or we can also use that wireless receiver transmitter to send information from the safe lock to be able to extract information such as audit trails. Now, if you're familiar with some of the safe locks on the market, they use a device called a Dallas key, which looks like this. And essentially what they do with this, it's a small memory chip. And uh, what they do is they um, attach it to a reader on the entry pad and download the audit trail into this memory wafer. Then they take it back to their software, plug it in, and they get the audit trail information off this uh, memory. We don't use this type of technology because we feel it's a really old technology and it's somewhat problematic. So instead of using a Dallas key, we use this device called a wireless link. And the wireless link looks like an iPod, it's about the size of an iPod, has an LCD screen, has a couple of buttons for control, but it is a device that talks wirelessly to the entry pad. It's local connectivity, so it works within a range of about 30 feet or so. But uh, what happens is if you wanted to extract an audit trail from the, uh, the safe lock, you would bring this device to the location, you'd turn it on, and I'll show you where to go in the menu system in order to uh, begin its uh, initiation. And then you um, uh, extract the audit trail from the safe lock by entering the uh, manager's code. I'm going to show you how to do that. So first of all, I would turn this wireless link on. There's a button on the side here. I just push up on the button. It opens it up and now it's ready to receive information. So on this, I would press the menu button and then press menu again to wireless connection. And I'd press menu again, or okay, that same button, and it's now ready to receive data. On the safe lock, I would then select the menu button, go down to system menu and press okay, enter my manager code, showing that I have validation in the safe, then scroll down to wireless connection and press OK. What you can see it's doing is it's transferring wirelessly all of its information in the audit trail from the safe lock to the wireless link. It's transferring information now. It counts down the number of events that it's sending. And in this case, it has sent over 500 events. All audit trail information has now been received by the wireless link. I simply turn this off go back to my head office, take this device with me, I plug it in by USB into my laptop, and it uploads all the information automatically from this device into my software. And now I can sort the report, I can filter it, I can print it, I can save it, do all of the types of things that you need to do with audit reports. This wireless link holds 5,000 audit events, so you can go from safe to safe to safe, collecting the information, take it back, and now you have all the audit information. So that's how to extract the audit trail from a ProLogic or ScanLogic series system that has wireless connectivity using the wireless link.